How to resize your animation shot in Calipeg. Here my animation is a full HD animation, 1920 by 1080 pixels, and I would like for example to make it a square. Just go to your settings here, then to the new resize tab, you have the size of your original shot here, then I can decide to make it a square by defining the same size here, and I can either resize the same shot here, so it will be done over that shot, or I can create a new shot, which will be a different shot in my studio. I can reset the settings here, lock the ratio, and move it anywhere. I can also go from pixel to percentage, so if I would like to get a 50% resize, so I can either do this here to resize to a specific part of my shot, or I can stretch the image. So my entire shot is included in my new resized shot. You can resize like this. If you don't stretch the image, it will be like this. I can move it freely like that, and also use the magnetism to fit in the center, for example. You have different presets to make it half the size, keep the same size, double the size, and you can add your own preset. For example, here, double the size will be a 4K shot. I can tap on plus, and then I can reorder my presets. And I can also slide on it to delete. So if I want to make a new shot from this shot here, going from Full HD to 4K, and extending what's around my animation to make other animations here, for example, I don't stretch the image and I create a new shot. So here I have my new shot, which is now a 4K shot with all the empty space around my animation. And just to finish my beginning example, I want to make it a square. I will not stretch and I will resize within the same shot. So this cannot be undone because it will just write over the shot. And now within the same shot, I have my new ratio. And that's how you can resize your animation shots within Calipeg. You can try Calipeg on iPad for free for 7 days, and then you can choose between a subscription or a one-time payment. And you can also get Calipeg Mini on your iPhone App Store for a tiny price just once.